During my 10-hour stream yesterday, I was trying to get banned while cheating blatantly in competitive non-prime matchmaking. The goal wasn't to get banned as fast as possible, but to see how long I could last while basically rage botting without anti-aim. I was getting over 80% headshots each game. If you guys were wondering, it took me 19 games to get banned. From joining the game after the load screen to the end game where it kicks you back to the main menu, it took me 8 hours, 21 minutes, and 19 seconds to get banned. Yes! But if you're thinking to yourself, why was the stream 10 hours? It's because of the wait times in the main menu. Sometimes I like to randomly queue with people inside of my stream, and they're not exactly from America, so the queue times take a really long time. If you were wondering how long the queue time was for me in the stream, it took me 2 hours, 4 minutes, and 38 seconds. And you guys wonder why I want a solo queue. With only 4 teams surrendering and 1 game tied, the last game only took me 17 minutes and 30 seconds. That wasn't even the shortest game of them all. To be honest, I didn't think I'd last this long. Before the stream started, I estimated 4 games before getting banned. That is assuming everyone reported me. Now, let's assume everyone on the enemy team were just randoms. That would be 95 reports. Now, let's assume my teammates were also randoms. That'd be 76 reports. 76 plus 95 is 171 reports. 171 reports on one person surely would have banned them. Now, before I was stating I didn't want to use an anti-aim because I knew VACnet would have banned me pretty fast. VACnet detects when your mouse movement is a bit iffy and weird. Basically meaning if you were looking at the ground and you shot, flicked up at a person, and flicked back down, VACnet will ban you. Now, what I was starting to do in my last game was mess around with the FOV, basically setting it to 180, allowing me to shoot people who are behind me. This is starting to sound like anti-aim, and that's because it basically is. At the time, I wasn't really thinking about it clearly and ended up getting banned because of that. Or maybe I got banned because I was reported a shit ton, which would make sense. Now, before the stream started, my account was Silver 1, and I only went up to a Silver Elite, basically meaning I only went up 4 ranks. Usually people in Silver rank call cheats on enemy players and report them randomly, thinking, thinking that they're cheating, when in reality, they're just better than them. Now, let me ask you this. Did I randomly get banned by VACnet, or was it because of the amount of reports that I got? You guys tell me. If you guys want to check out the full stream, it will be in the description with timestamps and everything. Hopefully my next stream will be me rage botting to high hell, attempting to get banned as fast as possible. Look at this. 10 hours, you guys. Thank you, guys.